Dancing on Ice, the semi-final takes place tonight, Sunday, March 1st, on ITV at 6 p.m. For one more week, the remaining four celebrities will be hoping to impress judges Jane Torville, Christopher Dean, Ashley Banjo and Jason Gardner and the answer at home to make it into the final. Last week, former Pussycat Dong Melody Thornton hung up her skates for good nut who will be the next to leave. Who will leave Dancing on Ice 2019? Question mark Week 9 sees bookmakers place their bets on Brian McFadden and his partner Alex Murphy to leave Dancing on Ice next. He is at odds of 8-11 to be eliminated from the competition next. Last week, Brian was also the favorite to leave at odds of 4-7 to go but was saved to skate another week. Alex a party of Ladbrokes said, Brian has done well to hold on up to this point but the odds suggest he'll fall at the final hurdle this weekend. Jessica Bridge from Ladbrokes added, Unfortunately it's against all odds that Brian makes. The dancing on ice final this year, with Sarah expected to line up with Dead Certs and James. However, professional dancer, performer and choreographer Stephanie Wallace Carr, who is the current creative director at LMA had a different opinion. Speaking exclusively to Express.co.uk she said Brian is the one contestant who impressed her the most. The choreographer said, Brian McFadden has impressed me the most. Okay, he has a performance background but I don't think he is a trained dancer like some of the others. Brian is charismatic, he is hardworking and passionate something that shines through when he is skating. Who are the dancing on ice couples? Brian is closely followed by Sarah R. Alto and her partner Hamish Gaman to go next. She is at odds of 6 fourths at Big Fair and Paddy Power to go next. It is looking likely that Sarah and Brian will face each other in the skate off and it will be up to the judges to decide who will skate another week. Both contestants have been in the dreaded skate off before, so they will be well rehearsed on the nerve wracking process. Love Islands is Nelson and his partner Vanessa Bauer are at odds of 51 to be eliminated at Bitfair and Paddy Power. Strictly Come Dancing James Jordan and Alexandra Shawman are at odds of 14-1 to go at Bet365. Here is a look at Ladbroke's odds for dancing on ice tonight. Brian, 8-11 Sarah, 11-8 James. 16 slash ones, 33 slash one Gemma Collins best dancing on ice moments her will win dancing on ice 2019 question mark throughout this year's competition. It has been a close tie between Love Islands is Nelson and strictly professional James Jordan. Over the past few weeks, they have been neck and neck to be crowned the winner by the bookies. They have also been very close on the dancing on ice leaderboard. It was us who scored the first 10 of the season last week, awarded by skating legends Jane Torville and Christopher Dean. And his partner Vanessa scored 42.5 for their performance to Treasure by Bruno Mars. James and his partner Alexandra were close behind with a score of 40.5 for their performance to meet the Flintstones. Nelson is the favorite to win Dancing on Ice this year across the bookmakers board. He is at odds of 4-9 at best 365, Skybet and Bitfair to win. On the other hand, James Jordan is at odds of 9 fourths at Bit Victor, Bitfred, and William Hill. The third favorite to win is Brian McFadden. Despite him also being the favorite to go this weekend, he is at odds of 14-1 to win at Paddy Power, Sky Bet, and Bitfair. Alex Aparty from Ladbrokes said, he may not have been crowned Love Island champion but all the signs point towards us becoming king of the ice. Ladbrokes odds for the dancing on ice winner are 2 slash 5 James 11 slash 4 Brian 10 slash 1 Sarah 20 slash 1 Will James Alls win? 
Stephanie Wallace Carby leads James, and Brian will make it to the final of Dancing on Ice next weekend. She said, I think Nelson might win he has so much natural charisma whilst his performances are energetic and entertaining. I feel like he always gives 110% and is fearless which I believe is essential to get the best out of a skater, the British public also really like him. So I think he has a great chance of winning. She also added, I think Z gets the votes of the teenage girls, he's popular amongst the lass. Love Island is one of the biggest shows on TV right now that can only help with his popularity, and he is a good skater. Okay, and it also helps he is so good looking. On the other hand, speaking previously to Express.co.uk, Linda Luzardy, a former contestant on Dancing on Ice and former glamour model confessed James Jordan is her winner. She said, hands down. My winner is James Jordan. He is amazing. Plus being a professional dancer, his lines and shapes are actually better than some of the professional skaters. He couldn't skate, start with but being fit, fearless and having the ability to take on choreography, it has easily helped him to learn more quickly. Dancing on Ice airs every Sunday at 6pm on 